Okay, so this is the first video I've recorded since um, the video you're about to watch. Um, I'm watching it for the first time. Uh, this is the hardest video I've ever ever had to post um, or even ever had to watch in my life. So um, it's supposed to be called hearing our baby's heartbeat for the first time and we didn't get the best news. Um, anyways, this video is really close to my heart, but I still want to post it because um, I know that you guys are on this journey with me and um, oh my gosh, sorry. Uh, anyways, I don't really have a lot of words right now because it's really hard to even talk, um, but I don't, I don't know. Good morning, guys. Come on, Thor. Welcome back. So today is actually super exciting. We are going to our very first doctor appointment. And I'm actually a little bit nervous because I'm not sure like what to even expect. But when we go to the doctor, I guess we'll kind of see exactly how far along I am for sure. And I don't know if we'll be able to hear the baby's heartbeat for sure or even see the baby on the ultrasound. I'm not sure. I have no idea. I've never done this, but I've been feeling very sick this morning. Josh made me a piece of toast, but I'm still kind of feeling sick. So I'm gonna try to eat this banana. I hate when you can't get like the top of a banana. I'm also worried if I have to pee in a cup, if I'll be able to pee. If I have to drink more water. <laughs> kind of excited, kind of nervous. I hope everything looks good with the baby. It's, yeah, it's been crazy. It's actually real, so that's crazy. <laughs> All right. There's some banana for you guys. My shoes match, you guys. What happened to my hair? I'll tuck that in. Okay, I'm just waiting for Josh. Oh my gosh, I am feeling wheezy. I'm just gonna be honest, being pregnant is hard. First trimester, that's all I've been through so far. I'm going through right now, but it's hard. So sick all the time. And yeah, I can't really do anything because I'm literally gonna throw up every five seconds. So that's been great. But now I'm just so glad that everyone in my family knows. Finally told my last sister. Finally everyone knows. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is seriously my stomach. There he is, the future dad. Uh, hello. Hello. Ready? Mm-hmm. You excited? Yes. Especially if we yeah. can see the heartbeat or hear it. I don't know, I know if we'll be able to yet, but. He's been talking about this forever. He's so excited. And I just want to see that everything's going good, you know? Mm-hmm. All right, we're officially on our way. I'm actually like doing a little fill out thing you have to do before you get into the hospital on my phone. But Josh made a good point just barely. He's like, what if there are two? That would be crazy. This is the point where we find out, will we make sure if like there's only one baby or, or maybe two, I don't know. Yeah, I think. See, yeah. And it's it kind of just barely hit me that this is actually real. Like, like I, it's real being pregnant because I'm so sick, but like at the same time, I've never got to like, it's just weird that something is actually like inside of you, like. Yeah. So I think if I actually hear a heartbeat or if I actually get to see something, it's gonna be like so crazy. It's probably gonna like feel really real to both of us. Yeah. So that is really exciting. Yeah, I just haven't had a lot of time to think about it because I've been so sick, so I'm like, that's just like talking about like, yeah, I'm like, I'm just sick. So it's hard to think about a lot of fun stuff. This will be actually really exciting. I'm starting to feel a little better. So, yeah, on our way. Big moment for us, babe. If there's twins. That would be insane. That, I don't know. I cool if I could do that, but. That, that would be really hard, especially if, uh, being our first. God can't give you anything you can't handle. Yeah. We'd figure it out. As I was eating this banana, also another thing that's been going on is I've been breaking out like crazy on this pregnancy, but I hope you're allowed to eat before you go in. Yeah, I actually idea. have no idea. But they probably would have said something. But... Yeah, and I would have literally thrown, thrown up like five million times. I probably, I'm like so scared to throw up there. I'm not scared, but I don't know, not fun. Hopefully it's fine. So we said we're gonna do an ultrasound. 
Are you excited? Yes. Let me zoom in a little bit. There we go. Um, can you have my water? Because I have to do a urine sample. <laughs> this is my worst nightmare. I feel like I can never... Exciting. I know. I'm so excited. Pregnant at that yeah. point? Did we talk about that? I said we've been trying. Yeah. And yeah. You said come back at 12 months. But. Yes. It's perfect. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Were your periods pretty regular up till that point? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And how have you felt? Very sick. Yeah. Like super nauseated. <laughs> Throwing up every day. Oh, okay. Like, yeah. Yeah. How are you handling that? I feel like I handled pretty good, but. I had a little breakdown the other day because it was hard. <laughs> like, this is hard and I don't know when it's going to end. Like a sickness, you kind of like, yeah. this is going to last maybe like a week or a week and a yeah. half. Well, this too shall pass, or yeah. it should, right? The HCG levels usually peak somewhere between, you know, 9 to 10 or 11 a week. Then we should be at the worst of it. Have you? Do you feel like you need anything to prevent the nausea or to um, keep Yeah, I was going to ask because I can't even like barely get out of bed. Uh-huh. I feel so nauseated. I can't even do YouTube, really. <laughs> yeah, are you losing weight? No, I'm actually maintaining my weight. Okay. Up here just my mom decided to eat when I'm starting to feel sick, because that was worked for her, so I've been trying. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it works, sometimes I just end up throwing it up, but... Okay, big deep breaths. Heart and lungs sound good. said the ultrasound is next. I'm actually a little bit nervous. It'll be fun, huh? It'll be exciting. I hope everything's like okay with our baby. Yeah. I don't know what we'll be able to see yet. I don't know if we'll be able to hear the heartbeat. I don't know if we'll be able to see I what's know. going on exactly, but at least we're going to try. Hopefully we can see that the baby is healthy. Yeah. I'm nervous. <laughs> on back and make yourself comfortable. Okay. It's kind of nerve wracking. Yeah, it's uh, kind of, it's a lot to take in, right? Yeah. Okay, and actually, oh, I guess we're all right for like, you can, you can see that okay, right? circle here is the yolk sac so okay. it feeds the baby initially until the placenta takes over and then we're kind of looking at the head over towards this direction I'm going to try and elongate the longest measurement actually uh, a little way around on the head can you usually hear a heartbeat this early yeah with this oh, okay now, often we can see it oh, um, wow. with the flicker right on okay. but I cannot see the heart movement right now and typically I would be able to see that I'm looking really close and as you can see I've listened a couple of times just to see mm -hmm. and sometimes you'll see him jump a little bit as well There's a couple of things that we want to do today. Like I say, number one, I mean, you're measuring right on, you know, for the dates. We'll want to check an HCG level to see what the level of the pregnancy hormone is, and we'll want to repeat that in two days. And then we'll see if it's going up. I'll have you back again to, to look to see if we can see any uh, fetal heart movement. Probably the hardest thing today is, I mean, there isn't, there's no other circumstance where there's so much excitement and then potential for that to turn into the sadness, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Okay, that's not what I was expecting. Yeah. 
That was supposed to be exciting. It wasn't. I was just sad. Pretty much just sent up. I don't even know if we got it on film, but we pretty much just said that we should um, probably know that this is gonna end the miscarriage, which is probably the worst thing you want to hear. I was getting scared, and we couldn't hear a baby's heartbeat. And I was like thinking, this can't be real, this can't be real, it's gonna be there, and then it just never was. So, oh. 